Hey everyone, so today I wanted to film a review for you on the new Kat Von D Shade and Light Eye Palette. I just got this from Sephora during the VIB sale, so I did get a little, you know, discount on there. Um, anywho, I do already have the contour kit. Um, if that's what you want to call it, contour palette, whatever. Um, they are exactly like the same size and shape and everything. They come in the same size box. Um, the only difference is this one has silver. The contour kit has silver on the packaging. And this one has gold and then it says eye. So, you know, it's for your eyes. Anyways, um, they do come with a nice size mirror. And this has the same exact um, kind of layout as the contour kit. has the three big ones. And then this one has, instead of three little ones, it has three big ones. So, yeah. The um, palette, the palette, that's what it's called, right? The palette does come with this little um, guide thing, if that's what you want to call it. And it just shows you, um, you know, what you would do if you wanted to define your eyes, lift your eyes, balance your eyes. And then it also um, shows which colors would be for your base, your contour, your define, and your highlight. Um, so, like, the first section here, I will show you. This is um, the base colors up here on top. And then the ones here on the left would be the contour one, two, and three. And then the middle one is the define. So those are gonna be a little bit darker. And then the lightest ones are for your highlight. Um, the palette, oh my God, I scratched it. Why does that happen? The palette is defined, divided, not defined. The palette is divided into um, like three kind of quads if you want to call them so this is going to be like the neutrals and then the cools and the warms and I really like that because depending you know on your skin tone or you know what colors you want to use today that day if you want it to you know have more cool look you can just go for these colors in the middle and you know whatever um I will swatch these for you the names are kind of bizarre um but we will try so um, also, I forgot to mention, all of the light shades are going to begin with an L, just like the ones in the contour um, palette. They all begin with an L, and then the shade colors, which are the darker ones, begin with an S in the name. So, the first one here on the top is called Lattice. It's really weird. It's hard to say. And then the middle one is called Lazarus. And then this one here is called Ludwin. Ludwin? Ludwin. I don't know. Why would they make them so complicated? Who knows? Okay, then here, this brown one is called Samuel. Then we have Solas. I think that's how you say it. <laughs> and then there is... L Lucens, I think that's what it's called. Lucens, maybe. Who knows? Then the next one after that is called Salios, I think. Salios. Then we have Shax, which is just a black, and then Liberatus. Liberatus. I don't even know what these names come from. Next one is. Succubus, I think, Succubus. Um, then we have Sentry, I think, Sentry. And L Lattice, Latin, I don't even know. Those are really hard to say. Good thing they are divided um, in the palette so you don't really have to look at the name because they're kind of hard um so i will show you guys some swatches the first three on top i'll do first there is those 
in. Let me make sure. You can't really see this one, the lightest one, but that's what those three look like on the top. These are all the big base colors. Okay, now I will show you what these three look like. They're all super, super pigmented, very creamy, and there's those three. I'm sorry, the light ones are really hard to see, but you get the idea. They're light. <laughs> That's those ones, and those are part of the neutral part of the palette. Now we're going to do these three here in the middle, which are part of the cool quad. Okay, so there is those three. Very pigmented. And that's what they look like swatched. As you can see, the black is like super pigmented. It's hard to find a good pigmented black color. And I'm glad that they included a black in this palette because, um, like I said, if you did want to mix the um, colors and you didn't want to go, you know, divided by how they are, you can just, you know, mix this or with that or whatever, you know. And you got a black, which is nice. Next, I'm going to do... These three guys here. These are part of the warm quad. So that is what those look like. And then I will swatch them here for you. Very, very nice. They do go on a little weird at first. I feel like... Um, when I would put in the transition shade, it felt like it wasn't going to blend. But then after, you know, you worked at it a little bit, it did end up blending out really nicely. Um, and I did use the uh, neutral colors on my eyes today. I filmed a tutorial, so that will be up in a few days if you want to see how I got that. Um, also, what else did I want to say? palette is only available at Sephora and it is $46 but um, like I said I got a little bit of a discount just because I got it during the sale which is nice um, so yeah I do think that this palette is worth it just because of you know how many shades you get you get 12 shades and there's quite a variety and they are all um, neutral which is nice to have all of them together i hope you guys enjoy if you did then please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe thank you so much for watching bye